The Alex Jones trial continues today. Jones is expected to take the stand again sometime this week. Uh, he was test expected to testify on Friday, but his defense team decided that was best to hold off. Fox 61's Lindsay Kane is live in Waterbury as she's been every morning of the trial so far. She's got more on what we might see today. Good morning, Lindsay. Hi, good morning. Well, it does not look like Alex Jones is going to testify today. Court is about to be underway shortly. It's still unclear when he's going to take the stand this week. When I asked him on Friday, he said it would be sometime this week. It was just a matter of when he was called to come back. So now it's looking likely that could be tomorrow or Thursday. But now looking back to what happened on Friday, court adjourned a few hours early because Jones attorney through a surprise twist decided not to cross examine Jones and the family's lawyers did not have another witness that was ready to take the stand. His attorney Norm Pattis speaking outside of court calling that move strategic. We're satisfied with how he handled things. Um, we weren't persuaded that the cross examination was effective. We thought it was vicious and uncalled for and gratuitous. Mr. Jones will testify and he'll be the last witness in the case and he'll have the last word. Most of the discussions in the short court session on Friday were about what Jones was saying outside of court. Jones saying he didn't end up testifying because he didn't need to, saying the family's lawyers Chris Maddy destroyed himself during a heated argument in the courtroom last week. The family's lawyers concerned Jones' continuous comments will impact the jury, but the judge disagreed and instead reminded the jury to uphold their oath and stay away from Jones' press conferences. Now, it's still unclear who is expected to take the stand shortly. We are expecting the return of social media expert Clinton Watts, so that is a possibility for today. The families are also a possibility as well. So stick with Fox 61 News on air, online, and on Fox 61 Plus for the very latest on what's going on inside the courtroom. Live in Waterbury, Lindsay Kane, Fox 61 News.